Hey, Riddle here. I always feel like everyone should have art in their home. It's just a window into your life, and it kind of bookmarks and honors our existence here. And the thing about art, which is a myth, is that you have to spend a lot of money on it, and that you should only buy art from famous artists. A lot of people find this portrait beautiful. And all it is, is my friend Holly's daughter, 20-year-old daughter, daughter Addie, and we were walking on a hike, and there was a succulent growing down the hill, and I put it in front of her face, and I took a picture with my iPhone and had it printed on the internet, on canvas. I had the sides finished in green. It was an option. It was really inexpensive, and it, it really is beautiful hanging on the wall. Another example of just taking a photograph with your iPhone or a decent camera. Look at this. How joyful is that? This was at the Popper, Poppy Preserve in the Antelope Valley. And I had this printed on canvas as well. This is from an iPhone, believe it or not. And look at the quality of it. It really is beautiful, beautiful quality. Printed on the internet. I think this cost maybe $50 or $60 to have done not including the frame. The frame I had, you know, I had it professionally framed, but you can also find great frames at the thrift store. So why would you choose to have your walls empty when you could fill them with your life? Here's another painting, another photograph. Sorry for the light off the window. It's a darker piece. Uh, this is the Z zombie boy. He's actually a real person. He appeared on the runways and in some Lady Gaga videos. As you can tell, he's very committed to tattoos. But I thought it was just such a badass looking image that I took it and froze the image on my computer and actually took this photograph from my laptop with my iPhone and then had it uploaded and printed on poster paper. So this is a pretty large piece. But now if I didn't tell you I did this myself, wouldn't you think I paid a lot of money in a gallery for it? So the point is, honor your own life and fill it with beauty. And, you know, have some confidence and, and really love the life you're living and surround yourself with the good memories because it doesn't cost a lot, matter, a lot of money and it's much better than leaving your walls empty and leaving your life colorless. Thanks for watching.